待ちしれてめえもう一回言ってみろ<笑>こんな定例会意味ないって言ったんですよなんだとお前と話すくらいならバスへのキャバクラでブサイクな女とダベってる方がよっぽど有意義なんだよ<笑>てめえもう一遍言ってみろ<音声>組長さんよここらで一つはっきりさせときたいんだがな俺らは風間の親父に言われたから仕方なくてめえについてるだけなんだよ何風間の親父から俺のしのぎがどんだけ太い稼ぎか聞かされてねえわけじゃねえだろうそいつが俺の格ってやつだならそれなりに扱われねえとなあの桐生ならまだしもおめえみてえな幹部に尻尾振るしか脳のね青二歳に指図されるなんて真っぴらごめんだこっちは勝手にやらせてもらうぜてめえまだ話は終わってねえぞ黙ってみてなしのぎのお手本ってやつ見せてやるからよ広域指定暴力団東条会三代目会長セラマサル氏の葬儀会場から届いた映像です詳しい情報はまだ入っていませんが一人の男性が突然暴れ出したとのことで現場は大混乱になりました男性の身元はまだ分かっていません続報が入り次第お伝えしますにしちゃ派手にやってんなあんた<笑>寂しいこと言うじゃねえか桐生伊達さん風間がああ無事かどうかも今はだが風間の言ってたその100億というみやさ何をお前に伝えようとしていたわからないそうか伊達さん何で俺を助けるような真似四4かあんた丸棒に10年前の堂島殺し俺は上の意向を無視して突っ走って結果一家下ろされて今はつまらねえヤクザの相手してるお前と同じ今じゃ組織の鼻つまみだ女房と娘も愛想つかして出て行っちまったお前に関わったおかげで人生が狂ったんだキリュウ俺は今三代目の世良の殺しを追ってる手風あんたには助けてもらった借りがあるだが今の俺には登場会の百億が消え三代目会長が殺されたそして
さっきの騒ぎの中心はお前事件は動き出したんだ桐生一馬の出所を待っていたようにな持ってろ<笑>今じゃガキでも持ってるんだぜ俺は百億を探ってみるお前はそのユミって女かその二つの山は必ずどこかでつながってるお互いに協力した方がいいんじゃねえかそうだな分かったお前何か手がかりはあんのかいやとりあえず昔の馴染みに会ってみるセレナって店だそうかマスター話は済んだもう店開けて構わないぜはいお前が無所に入っている間にカムロ町も様変わりしただろうああなじみの定食屋がなくなってたな千両通りにあった店かあそこは潰れてデートクラブになってそれも潰れてキャッチバーになってまあそれも潰れてあれ次なんだっけなセレナか確か天下一通りだったよな何かあったらその携帯に連絡する頼んだぞじゃあなあらと See you around, I guess. Um, okay. How do we. Wait, okay. How's I supposed to look for. Emails? Whatever. Serena, I don't know if it's still there, but I better check it out anyway. Here we go. Cell phone. Nishita. My name is Nishita. Sorry for the sudden email. I work for Goro Majima, sir. My name is Nishita. I have a message from the boss. Kira chan, be sure to make a folder for all my emails. This was sent from my phone, but I wanted you to get it as soon as possible. Alright. Thanks, Nishita. See you later. Thank、you 
I sing for you. Time's almost up.
Excuse me, sir. You there? Hmm? Hmm? Are you talking to me? Yeah. Yes, yes, I am. What do you want? Not to intrude, but I'm a practitioner of palmistry, and the aura of your hands compels me. May I see them? Hmm. I've been burdened one too many times by this kind of thing. I'm not interested. Eh? Oh, no, 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 sir. Please. It would only take a moment. You're really starting to pester me. I won't even ask for money. This is purely to satisfy my burning curiosity. Please, show me your hand. Uh, fine. If it means that much to you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Now, let us see where these lines lead. Mm. Ah. And you have a stubborn streak. But it's also kind of a burning determination in its own way. Ah, could this be? Nani. What? There's a sign of struggle etched along these lines. This isn't looking good. Does a recent hardship ring any bells? Mm, I've had my fair share of hardships, but hasn't everyone? It's pretty vague. Too vague, you say? Then we must go deeper. May I see your palm once more, sir? I must see this through. Uh. Sh sure. I see it! The struggle ends in a drastic change. Has something you've believed in for a long time recently turned for the worse? A change in something I believed in? Could that mean Nishki? Or even Kazuma-san being shot? Ah, phew. I think that was more descriptive, right? You could see all of that in my hand? I mean, some recent events like those do come in mind. Not everything was perfect, but you got pretty close. Naturally, uh, sir, based on what I've read in your poems, I have some news that would, that would literally change your fate. Mm. Sounds pretty dramatic. Indeed. If you have a few minutes, I can change your life. Uh. Something that can change my life. Let's hear it, then. <laughs> a wise choice, sir. Uh, someday you'll look back on today and wonder how you ever lived before it. Right this way, please. <laughs> My name is Nakia from the Society of Saints, and this is our society's dean, Iwata-san. <laughs> it's an honor, sir. Uh. I'm Kiryu. Hey. You know, Iwata-san here has led an incredible life. He sequestered himself in the mountains of Balsk, meditated with the local monks, and has returned to Japan to share the mystical powers he acquired there. He is a demigod. Yeah. No, no, you flatter me. I was, I'm only a mortal man of some enlightenment. The monks called me Madari Bakitsu. Nani. Mada... what? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> it means peaceful pair. No need to remember it. Uh, I see. Kiryu-san, I apologize if this is out of the blue, but do you believe in fate? Mm -hmm. Fate? 
Eh. Yes, the belief that events are set in stone and certain things are preordained to happen at certain times. <laughs> nope. I've always believed you forge your own path in life. Maybe when I was younger I fell into that trap once or twice, but I've matured since then. <sighs> Perhaps you should have trusted yourself then. Because... In truth, every chance encounter, every threat of fate on Earth and within the universe is controlled by one god. You don't say. You don't seem fully convinced, so let's assume for the sake of argument that it's true. With that in mind, what if we told you that a person's fate could be changed? If I said that we have the power to alter the future, would you be interested? <clears throat> I'd say you're crazy, but I'll hear you out, I guess. <sighs> of course. No man alive could resist that kind of power. So just between us, if you had the power we possess, you too could weave the strands of fate to suit your will. Then What? Yes, a society of saints is the warden of a mystical art and to view the world in to to view the world differently, to see life itself through rose colored glasses. Rose colored. Hi. Yes, by donning a talisman imbued with a piece of an ancient ore known as the lifestone. The cosmos themselves will surround you with happiness. Top level athletes, famous politicians, even award winning movie stars all owe their success to this wondrous artifact. Well, that sounds pretty incredible. Eh. It was none other than, than it was none other than Iwata-san himself who discovered it. Mm. You did. Mm. Indeed, I guarantee the love stays positive energy is real. Mm. You claim this would bring happiness and a rose-colored view on life, but I think that's all pretty vague. Mm. Very well then. If happiness is the question, did you hear the news that Momo Kasan, the celebrity pop idol, just got engaged to a normal everyday citizen? What are the chances of a celebrity falling in love with some everyday salary man from the city? How could he have manipulated the threads of fate to see his dream realized? Could it be thanks to the stone? Hi. Yes, you're exactly right. The stone brought them together. <laughs> That's kind of amazing. Isn't it? For my next example, how about someone who's more familiar to both of us? I'm referring to me, of course. I used to be a down-on-my-luck cleaning solution salesman, but after gaining the Lifestone's power, well, look at me. <laughs> I earned 10 million yen in just one month. <clears throat> when was the last time normal people could earn that? Hey. Yes, that's why even a pebble of the Lifestone can bring about great change. Whatever you wish for will be yours. So, have I made a believer out of you? Uh, maybe. Then, Kiryu-san, we'd like to offer you the opportunity to buy this talisman. What's normally 500,000 yen will take down to 99,000 yen. You'll never find another investment as lucrative as this. Nani. What? You can't put a price on happiness, but we just did. The first step to, fulfilling, to a fulfilling life is in your wallet now, and no amount of money will be too great, right? To obtain success in life, love and laughter, one must take a leap of faith. And who knows, it could pay itself off before you even know it. This is a huge discount I'm offering, only to you, because of your incredible aura. Again, this could change your life. <laughs> so, how about it? <laughs> I'll buy it. Ah, a thousand thanks! Behold, the sacred talisman itself. May happiness be with you for the rest of your days. <laughs> You've made the purchase of a lifetime. I'm happy for you. Well, we have clients in many places, so we must hurry off. Would you be so kind as to cover our coffee tab? Thank you. What? <laughs> I think I made the right choice here. You know what? The world is looking a little rosier already. <laughs> yes, I'll take payment in cash, but really, how did you pull it off? Mm. Mm. Isn't that Nakia and Iwata? <laughs> I just guess it's his past, then got him worried about his future. He fell for a hook, line, and sinker. Easy pickings. You're a genius, Nakia-san. I know, right? Well, I'm off to scout the next round of gullible mooks, like fish in a barrel. <laughs> Good luck. May happiness be with you, or whatever. <laughs> Wait, was I just... Can't? What? Oi. Uh, oh, oh, 
Oh, Kirisan, was it? How are you? Uh, your luck must be improving by leaps and bounds already, right? I'd say. Seems I lucked into figuring out your scam. <coughs> what? I have no idea what you're talking about. You can lie all you want, but I just overheard you and Nakia talking about scamming me. Shit! Sounds like your luck just ran out then. Asshole! Accept your fate and die! Oh yeah? We'll see about that. <laughs> I'm sorry, it was Nakia. He paid me to do this. Wait, he's the one paying you? Mm. Yes, he said he had a lucrative scam going and all I'd need to do was pretend to be a leader of some society and he'd do the rest. Huh? If you don't tell me where he is, you're going to get real familiar with my palms again. Eep! I'm sorry. P please take this. My apologies. Naka should be near the Smile Burger on Nakamichi Street. If you want answers, he's the one to talk to. Near Smile Burger? He won't be smiling much longer. Oh, you're about to get what's yours, buddy. Just you wait. Think you're so tough? Oh. Excuse me, boys. Coming through. Got to see a man about a scam. Thank you. That's the Lifestone guy, and he's up to his same tricks. Oi. Oi, you. Huh? Ah! You! Can you predict why I'm here? Uh, uh yes, actually. Uh, uh, yikes. I'll give you 20,000 yen, and this Lifestone. Huh? Quit fooling around. You want to do this the hard way? Fine. Let's go, stupid. Oh yeah. After I'm done with you, you'll be one. You'll be the one feeling stupid. Mm. Mm. Who's the stupid one now? Uh, I'll never do this again. I swear. Some people buy into the stuff pretty easily, you know. You're just disappointing their fears. It's repulsive. <laughs> Only Irma fools would fall for something so stupid. Huh? Sounds like you've still got enough of that Lifestone's energy to spare. Shall I beat it out of you? S sorry, uh, I'll give this to you. So, come on, let me go. <sighs> I can't believe I fell for that. Seeing life through rose-colored glasses is a choice, not a product. Life will always have ups and downs, and if we don't have the bad parts, we'll never appreciate the good ones. Oh. Hey, Kiri-chan! Majima-san, sorry, but I'm in a hurry right now. I don't have time to humor you. Is that so? Well, that's good news. It is. See, you're in a hurry, and I don't plan on letting you get through. That means... You catch my drift. You catch my drift, don't you, Kiri-chan? If I want to pass, I need to fight you, don't I? <laughs> At least it makes sense. It does, don't it? But I ain't so weak that you get through me while your skills are still all shot to shit. If you, if you don't want to die, you better bring it. I wasn't planning on holding anything back. Bring it on.
Ooh, there you go. Man, you're starting to pack a punch, Kiri Chan. You never cease to amaze. You're looking pretty relaxed for having lost. Damn straight. I have so much fun fighting you. I can't help but feel good about it. The more we fight, the more pumped up I get. I could fight you forever. <laughs> you sure about that? But it looks like I lose this time. We could pick up where we left off later. See you around, Kira Chan. I can't avoid fighting with Majima-san. I need to be prepared at all times so I can face him whenever and wherever. Right, Dragon Kick Reborn. What's that? Oh, it's the first one. Running jump attack that was sent. Okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Fair enough. What? Are you Kazuma Kiryu-san? I am. Who's this? I am Nishida from the Majima family. I have a message from the boss for you, Kirasan. Oh, great. He said, I'm in front of the Millennium Tower right now. I'll catch you if you try to slip by, so they do don't even try. You've got his accent down. Pretty generous of him to start warning me about where he'll be, too. Yes, he also said, if you don't get confidence in your skills, you better not be packing heat. What? Don't walk around with any weapons. Especially not any knives or guns. And that's the message. That's all I had to say. Goodbye. He doesn't want me to carry weapons if I don't have confidence. That's an odd threat. But if Majma Sun is in front of the Millennium Tower, I guess I'd better be prepared if I plan on passing by. Alright. Something to keep in mind, I guess. Oh, insect card. What? Insect card? What's this? A drawing of a woman in a swimsuit wearing some weird headgear. <sighs> Dread, where'd it go? I worked so hard to get that card. No. Does that say well bred boy? What? Well bred boy, okay. Um, excuse me, sir. Have you seen a Misu King card nearby? Mesu King? What? You don't know Mesu King, mister? How is that even possible? Even toddlers know about Mesu King. Nani. Uh, what? <laughs> it's called Battle Bug Beauty's Mesu King, and it's just as popular as Pocket Circuit among kids. Fairies dress up as insects and battle out in the forest. It's exciting and super cool. So it's like putting a rhinoceros beetle and a stag beetle together to watch them fight? <laughs> I did that as a kid. Anyways, I just got this really rare inset card. I was so happy that I started running around all excited with it. And then I guess I dropped it somewhere. A card, huh? Couldn't be that weird swimsuit women card I found, could it? That can't be this kid's Miso King thing. Is this the card you're looking for? Wow, yes, this is it. Thank you so much, mister. No problem. Try not to drop your cards anymore. I can't believe this is a kid's game. Children are so much more mature these days, aren't they? Oh, mister, you've never played Miso King, right? Uh. No, never he even heard of it before. Hee <laughs> hee, <laughs> you should come by Club Sega sometime. You can usually find me there. I'll teach you how to play Miso King to thank you for finding my card. Miso King is a game that's all the rage among kids, huh? Guess I can stop by when I got time. I got some time to play. Sure, I'm feeling pretty childish today. Let's do it. <gasps> oh, mister! You actually showed up? Uh. Yeah. I'm a little curious to see what this Mr. King card game is all about. <laughs> Alright, I'm sure it can be ap appealing to adults too. Mm. Pretty sure it's meant to appeal specifically to adults. But, what if it isn't? 
It could actually be a family game meant for... meant purely for kids. You can play Mr. King using this machine. The story behind Mr. King is that good insect fairies need to fight against the bugs that suddenly turn bad. You use four cards to make a deck, an insect card and three skill cards. Insect cards summon an insect into battle, while skill cards are abilities for your insect. So, since you found my card for me the other day, I want to give you this. Are you sure you want to me? Are you sure you want to give me all these? Oh, don't worry. Those are all doubles of cards I have. Besides, I always love making more friends to play with. I'm not sure I'm ready to play this. I have no clue what kind of game this is. Heh, <laughs> well that's where I come in. I'm famous around here. People know me as Professor Mesoking. <laughs> I'll teach you everything you need to know. Whenever you get a new card, make sure to show it to me, okay? Professor Mesoking, what a nickname. And let me know if you want to play against me. Uh, uh sure. Thanks. So, Mesoking. Maybe I'll give it a shot. Hmm. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Say that I can play using this machine? Hmm? Mm hmm? Do you even realize how much money I've spent on this stupid UFO catcher? I bet the thing's rigged so it can't be won. Yeah. No, no, I assure you, we don't do that here, sir. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah? Then why can't I get it? He's so loud, I can't focus on my game. What's this now? It's getting pretty noisy. Is there a problem here? Uh, welcome. Uh, I'm very sorry about the noise bothering you. Hmm. This customer is upset he hasn't won any... Oh, this customer is upset he hasn't won any UFO catcher prizes. Uh -huh. I spent it with 10,000 yen and I've got nothing. I feel like it's not even possible to win something. Ah, so that's what's going on. What do you want so badly? The white buncher. Mm -hmm. Bunchan? Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's a buncher bird. A stuffed white java sparrow. So, my little girl keeps asking for that white buncher. So she says she wants it more than anything the whole world. Mm -hmm. Your daughter sounds pretty demanding. <laughs> well, you see... She's not exactly my daughter, per se, but she does like to call me her daddy, so... <coughs> Don't make me say that stuff out loud! It's embarrassing! So, you're determined because your daughter begged you? Yeah. Yeah, it's rare that she asks for something. Of course, when she does, it's not money or something I can just buy. <coughs> I think these types of games just come naturally to some people. Some are naturally good. Others are naturally bad. Whoa. Oh, I know. If you have... Oh, I know. If you happen to get a hold of a white bunchan doll, could you let me have it? Men. What? Please. I need that white bunchan, no matter how the cost. I'm begging you. Don't be stupid. Why would I want to do that for you? Because I'll pay you loads of money for it. Please. Mm. Sorry, but I don't have that stuffed animal. Mm. Oh, really? Sorry. Kuwana Ladybug. Welcome to a cup cigarette. Oh, can I help you? Okay. Uh, right. So, is this the only playable game here? UFO Catcher and, um,. Miso King? Okay. Where is that? W okay, I don't see a white bunch in. So. So ask him to change the prizes. Thanks for waiting. Ah. Is this it? The pink, the pink bird. I I'm guessing. Sure. Okay, so... Alright, here we go. 
Eh. Oh, what? <laughs> what was that? Kidding me? What a ripoff. You're gonna make me do this every time, too? All right, here we go. What? How is that even possible? Oh my God, why does it take so long? Why does it take so long to get to the to the end? Oh man, this is gonna be a nightmare. Hurry up! Of course. gonna take a while. Why does it take so long? God damn it. Fuck you. Thank you. Look, 
Okay, that counts. Sure. I'll take it. Give me that shit. I got the ping bird. That's all I care about. You, you, do you have the white bunchen for me? I promise I'll make it worth your while if you give me one. <laughs> Sorry, but I don't have that one. Mm. Oh, really? Erg. Oh, he did. He did say white, didn't he? Uh, okay, well, let's do this again, I guess. Uh-huh. Alright then. <coughs> Here we go again. Do you want to 
Okay, then. Okay. <sighs> Whatever, man. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna question that. That's it. I'm done. I'm out of here. You, you, do you have the white bunch on for me? I promise I'll make it worth your while if you give me one. I have that stuffed animal you want. R really? Please, I need it. Give it to me. What should I do? This is the one you're looking for, right? Y you're a much kinder person than I thought you'd be. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, um, if you don't mind, may I ask what your name is? Uh. Kiryu. Kiryu-san. Got it. I definitely won't forget your name. Oh, sorry for being rude. I'm Sasaki. I know it isn't much, but please take this. This seems like a lot for a little toy. Are you sure? Yeah. Absolutely. It's much cheaper than how much I'd end up spending trying to get it myself. I'll be sure to let you know if I need something else. Bye! Okay then. Oh, look. Look at what? Hmm, a photo booth. I happen to have a photo book on hand. Okay. You can stick photos you've taken in this book. You may also switch out previous pictures you've taken with new ones. Photo booth, eh? It's 400 yen for one turn. Should I take some photos? Okay. Alright. I'll take a shot at it. What? Okay. Is this gonna be like a mini game? What? Select frame photo. Select pose. Cancel. Select pose. Okay. What? Huh? Okay. Uh, what? Huh? What? What? What's going on? What? Huh? What's going on? Uh, did I win? What's happening? I don't understand what is what? Huh? Hello? Hello? Alright. Hello again. Where am I? Oh, my okay. god. Uh, fuck. <laughs> At least it saved after I got that <coughs> dumb animal. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh. 
Can't skip cutscenes though. Yeah. It's the closest thing you'll get to skipping them. Alright. Well, thankfully we can also do manual saves. So, that's gonna be helpful. Alright. So. While I was resetting, I found out that, uh, I found out what, or how, how are you supposed to, okay, so, yeah, you're selecting poses, you're selecting poses, so, during each photo, you can choose from four to, f from four po po poses to, to do, fuck. You'll see, okay. I don't know what the poses are, but, whatever. Okay, so that's pose one, I guess. Oh, pose two. That's pose three. That's pose four. Oh, and that was a perfect shot, I guess, or whatever. Yeah, sure. Oh, please don't crash on me this time. Okay, so that's the picture you want to swap with. Okay. Cool. Auto save complete? Okay. Okay. So the first one, the pose 2, is going to be the trickiest because it's the fastest. I don't know if we can. Oh. oh fuck that up. Was that also bad? Damn. Were these all bad? None of them are perfect. Apparently. None of them are perfect? Okay. Well, that's a shame, I guess. <sighs> Alright. Let's try again. No, possible. I don't know. Fuck that up too. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Ah. I don't have to print the photos. I could just quit. Okay. Well, that makes things a little bit faster. Yeah. Fuck off. Yeah, I mean, the first one's... That's definitely gonna be the trickiest. Alright, we'll do that one... We'll do that one later. Okay, let's try to do pose three. Nope. Too late. I don't know. There we go. Somehow that's good. Nope. Fuck that up. Alright, well. We got one good one, so that's something. It's something worth celebrating, I guess. <clears throat> Fuck. Spider <sighs> Okay. 
And was that too? Was that too early or too late? Okay, whatever. Oh, I can select multiple. Okay. Sure. I don't understand. Am I too am I too early or too late? Gotta give me something to work with. My man. Am I too early or too late? Whatever. <clears throat> All right, one more to go. Last one. Here you go. The fucking the photo booth boss fight. <clears throat> right. Okay. I'm guessing I'm too late. It's also too late. Is that too? Okay. I'm trying to press it as soon as the arrow starts moving. Uh, okay. Is it possible that I'm too early? Okay. No, I pressed it late. And that didn't work too. Hmm. No. It's definitely too early. Is that too late? Maybe that's too late? Spider no. Damn, yeah, I don't I don't know how to Yeah. I don't know what the timing is supposed to be. Cause it's it's definitely not one it's definitely not when the arrow is on the on the button. Cause by the time you press a button, it's too late. But even when you're too early, it's like way too early. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand. At least with karaoke, they tell you if you're too early, too late, good, bad. With this, it's a compl complete mystery. Let's 
少し照れるな。Seems like I've tried out all the timings. I try to be. I try to be too early, I try to be too late. I try to be on the sweet spot. Nothing's working. Yeah, nothing works. Okay, I'll try to press it as soon as it hits the button. Okay, I was a little late there. I hit that as I hit that as soon as I hit the button. Yeah, okay. Fuck this game. I'm not I'm not doing that anymore. Poorly explained, poorly executed. Enough said. Oh, mister! Do you feel like a game of Mr. King now? Uh. Yeah. You gave me a Mr. King card. Least I could do is give the game a fair shot. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> I knew you'd say yes, mister. Well, first, you can try a practice game with me. Uh. Okay, sure. Oh, but first, each Mexican king got 100 yen. That okay? Uh. Yeah. Great! First, I'll explain the basic gameplay. I'll choose attacks in a set order. Rock, scissors, then paper. You'll want to choose attacks that beat them, mister. Attacks that beat rock, scissors, paper in that order. So I want to choose paper, rock, then scissors, right? Let's do it. Alright, here we go. Uh, okay. Super attack. Uh... Hundred and twenty strength. Hundred technique. Forty throwing. Eh. Compatibility chart. Okay. She's more compatible, so sure. Let's give it a shot. Face measure. Omni choke. Body slam. Yes. Let's do it. Paper, rock, scissors, huh? Okay. Ooh, who's this? The mystical stag beetle. Sure. I see, I see. I'm on the left. Okay. Uh, paper, rock. Uh, 
All right. And then scissors. Ooh. Kablamo. Uh, oh. Okay. I guess I can choose anything now. Ah. Oh. On a. I see. On. On a draw, both both fighters. But I on a draw, both fighters take damage. Okay, it's good to know. <laughs> you did it, Mister. You have the basic rules down. <laughs> huh? The game is basically rock paper scissors, right? I played that as a kid. <laughs> it's true that rock paper scissors is the base of the game, but it's a lot deeper than you, what you've seen so far. Oh, so it could get pretty interesting. Maybe I'll drop by from time to time to keep playing it. That'd be great. You're always welcome to join me. I'll have you battle some of my friends next time, so try your best. <laughs> Thanks. See you around, kid. Alright. I'll try to build me a nice deck first, and then we'll talk. Mm. Mm. Isn't that Sasuke, the businessman that I gave Bunchan to a while ago? Mm. Hey, looking for something specific again? Whoa. Oh, Kirisan, thanks for getting me that Bunchan the other day. So, which one is in your sights today? My girl wants the entire Wu Fam series. Mm. Wu Fam, what's that? Mm. Well, it's a series of Oxalot of stuffed animals. There are three different toys that make up the Wu Fam series. Wu Papa, Wu Mama, and Little Wu Kun. She's saying she wants all three to decorate her room. <laughs> Sounds like she's just as much of a handful as ever. <laughs> sure, but that's part of what makes her so cute. She knows just how to get what she wants by whispering it in your ear. <clears throat> Anyways, I know I'm asking a lot, but if you have the whole Wu Fam series, would you possibly let me have it? I knew you'd say that. Please. Uh, you know I'll give you good money for it. Can you please give it to me? Sorry, but I don't have that one. Mm. No, man. Really? Oh. Okay, that's gonna be our next challenge. A whole family of axolotls. Sure. How hard could it be? Oh. Uh. Oh. Still not there. Can you change him again, please? There you go. See now. Uh, okay, these are a bunch of monkeys. Not really where. I, okay, no. Still, still not what I want. Is it possible to ask for specific prizes, or does that count as cheating or something? Ah, oh, there we go. All right, let's give it a shot. Alright. Not a great start, but let's try again.
There we go. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh, here we go. Here we go. What's going on? What's happening? And... There we go. Got Papa in our sights. Moving on to Mama. Come on, Mama. That's unfortunate. Let's see if we can still get Mama from this position. Steady. Steady does it. Stay on target. Hey, a twofer. Yep. Uh, thanks. Alright. It's time to get the sun. Uh oh. 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 Ooh. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. All right. We can try again. It's fine, it's fine. We're getting closer and closer. No problem. Keep doing this for as long as it takes. I've already gotten two, so... Now is not the time to back down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hurry up. Hurry up. Come on. Let's go. Got places to be. Here we go. Here we go. This is the one. Here we go. Let's get her done. There we go. Can't escape me this time, pal. This is the end for you, for you, for, I, alright, that's what I thought, yep, <sighs> goodbye, are oh, you about to give me the entire Wu Fam series, I'll repay you immensely for this, I have those stuffed animals. Uh -huh. R really? Please, I'm begging you. Please give me that set. Mm. What should I do? These are the ones you were looking for, right? Oh my gosh, thank you, Kirisan. Really, thank you. Mm. No problem. Is it really that important to you? I uh, know this isn't much, but please take it. <laughs> Thanks to this, I'm gonna have a happy ending tonight. 
I'll let you know if I need something else. Bye, Kusan. Alright. Till next time, I guess. I better go to the MAB to gather information. Uh, whatever that means. Damn it. Of all the time this could happen. Why now? I can't believe myself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That guy seems pretty upset. Oi. Oi. What's the matter? Ooh? Huh? Oh, well. I was all excited to see the show at this bikini bar, but I forgot to bring my glasses. <sighs> no, I don't know what to do. I skipped out of work early for this. <clears throat> glasses, huh? Even if I wanted to help him, I don't have anything on me. <sighs> Sigh. Okay, what? I'm supposed to go out and get glasses? What do you want? Can I help you? Yeah, sorry, bud, but you're on your own. Hmm. Oh, is this the... Oh, is this the place that I snuck out of while, while trying to evade... Awano and Kuze and his goons? Huh. Oh! What? That's it? What do you mean that's it? Where are the exotic dancers? I've been promised top quality dancing here. What's going on? What? Let me in! Oh! There we go. Okay, it's a bit confusing. Oh, there we go. What? It's just a bunch of old dudes. Am I supposed to, like, sit down? There's no one here! Where are the dancers? This stinks. I'm out of here. You know what? I wouldn't bother trying to find my glasses if I were you. There's nothing in there. Bunch of old dudes sleeping. That's it. What a waste. <laughs> oh, how's that hanging, handsome? What? Oh, are you talking to me? Of course. Oh, and now that I have a closer look, I can see you're not just handsome, you're really hot. I'm Ruby. What's your name, hottie? Uh, Kiryu. How about it? Wanna hang out for a while? <laughs> sure thing. Hehe, <laughs> he. you have such a sexy voice. I'm already turned on. Then, shall we go? Right this way, hot stuff. Mm. Uh, where are we going? Mm. Where? Oh, that'd be quite curious, son. Sure, uh. we'll see where this goes. Fine, lead the way. Hehe, <laughs> <laughs> and let's go. She's probably gonna rip me off. Tee come closer. Nanny. Wait, this isn't. Are you a guy? Whoa. <laughs> 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 What's wrong? Got more get more than you bargained for? <coughs> well, at least I had fun, curious on. Two stunt to even say a word, baby? <laughs> uh what a sad man you are. 
carers, huh? <laughs> nice work, bro. Another victim of the oldest trick in the book. You got his wallet, right? So you two make a habit of this? Really? Huh? Don't tell me you've still got some fat in you after my brother gave you the complete package. Fine. Guess it's my turn to shut you then. You to steal from me. <coughs> Sis, you okay? Men. Sis, so you're a man and she's a woman? Uh -huh. What's wrong with that? You just messed with my sister, so now it's on, jerk! Man. This is a crazy world we're living in. Crazy world. Die, you freak! Die! Ungodly abomination! To the depths of hell with you! Mm. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Stay down! Stay down! Sit down. I give up. You're too much for me. I don't care what gender you are. It was trying to scam me that. It was trying to scam me that guy into this position. Huh? Are you listening? We're not gonna apologize for being who we are. I'm sick of the weaker guys from now on. Hmm. I really need to be less gullible. Alright. I hate to leave any loose ends, so I'm gonna go back to uh try to get a try to get more than ninety on the um which one was it? This one. A G Sakura. Is this the oh Okay. This is probably the best new song from this game. So, alright, let's do it again. Starts off slow, very slow, and then suddenly ramps up. And that's, I think that's what caught me off guard last time.
<laughs> right, that was a bit of a mess, but wasn't so bad, right? Okay. Well, it's more than 90, so I'll take it. Uh, request ranking. What? Uh, okay. High score. Alright. Hmm. So, Bakamitai and Eiji Sakura are on the lowest. If I can get a high score on both of those, I could probably fill up the entire leaderboard. But, you know, I didn't do that. I did what I came here for. It's time to leave. <laughs> yep. Uh, it's empty. Oh, is that want us another drink? So, uh, anyway. Mm -hmm. That drunk seems to be really craving another drink. Excuse me, Mr. Drunk. Oh. Hold on, let me get this. It's another one of those... One of those mysterious coin locker keys. I don't know what they're up to. I don't know what they're all about, but... There you go. Excuse me, sir. Oi, Oi are you alright? You look pretty wasted. I am fine. All right, good. Yeah. Say, you got any sake, buddy? Nani. What? Sake. Ah. Yeah. All I need is another swing. Just gotta wet my lips. <laughs> got some or not? Yeah. Sorry, but no. Nothing good ever comes from giving a drunk more to drink. <sighs> what do you mean? <laughs> You're a stingy guy, you know. I don't have any sake. What do you want from me? Oh. The fuck is this? Hey. What? Stuck in the tree. How am I supposed to get it? Okay. What happens if I say yes? Yes? I got some sake. Ooh. Wait, I don't have any sake on me. Oh, you are too? No, go, no, go. Won't you come back to me? It would make him happy. Maybe I'll buy him some. Oh, now it's okay? Because if it's only to make him happy, then sure. Okay, Kiru, whatever you say. <clears throat> Stop and leave him alone, Kiru chan. Great, a cop with an attitude. Wait, did he just call me Kiru chan? Majima-san? <laughs> are you actually surprised? Uh. Yeah, actually I am. What the hell are you doing? Well, we heard rumors about a guy rampaging through town with a bat and a dagger. So the Majima family is on the case. Mm. Pretty sure that'd be you. <laughs> so, Kiryu-chan, I'm gonna have to pat you down to see if you're carrying any dangerous items. Mm. You really have that kind of authority? Of course I do. I ain't gonna let you off the hook just cause I know ya. Now show me the goods. What do my possessions have to do with this? Shut up and spread them. You got anything you're trying to hide? Oh, perhaps you got a smut video inside that jacket of yours. I don't... Jeez, fine. If I show you, you'll be satisfied, right? You did say not to walk around with a weapon. I don't think we have a weapon on us. What have we here? Naughty, naughty, Kirchen. You have a weapon. Tch, you found it. Oh, I do have. I do have some stun guns that I got from helping out NPCs. Huh? Not good, Kirchen. What were you thinking walking around in public with a dangerous item like this? As an officer of the law, I gotta make sure you pay for your crimes. It's in my very moral fiber. Hmm? What? Then from the very beginning, you were trying to... I told you, didn't I, Kiri-chan? If I can give you a proper reason, you'll have to fight me. Fine then. Bring it on.
You ain't taking me alive, officer. That much I can guarantee. Stand down, officer. <sighs> Fighting you was the only choice I had, but I haven't fought like that in a while. Huh. Yeah, looks like you're on the way to regaining what you lost. All my hard work is paying off with sweet, sweet returns. But don't get cocky. You ain't your old self by a long shot. Your ten-year gap was a massive ravine he's got you still got across. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna keep doing this? Uh -huh. Damn straight! Till I get the man worthy of being called the Dragon of Dojima that I want to fight, and you're gonna be in my sights. Uh -huh. Seriously. <laughs> now I'm not gonna force you to fight me next time. <laughs> Just the thought of it gets me fired up. He has a point. Majima-san's constant interruptions are making me regain my old strength. Maybe these fights are inevitable. Still, if I ever plan on carrying a weapon, I better be careful so Majima-san doesn't find out. Good thing. 